Hello everyone. Welcome to our blog, A Quiet Life. Thanks for being here. You're probably looking for an update on brachial radial puritis. Brachial radial puritis is an intense itching and burning. For me, it's on my right arm, it's on my forearm, my elbow, or the um, top of my arm and it is so intense and it's it feels like a burning itch and you cannot help but scratch it and it doesn't do any good to scratch it nothing helps it nothing topical helps it you can't take a medicine to help it because what it is for me it's a nerve in my my spine into my neck and it goes down into my right arm and the sunlight triggers this nerve so from may till november i can have this intense burning and itching on my arm. When I was in high school, I did have a, a sun poisoning on my forearm, on my right arm, which is where it's at. And I also clean houses, so I use my arm a lot. I garden a lot. I work outside a lot. I do a lot of home projects a lot. So I'm constantly using, especially my very dominant right arm. And though I do have a lot of problems with my hand, my elbow, my shoulder, you know, my right side, actually, I have a lot of problem with my right hip, uh, the side of my foot goes numb, my fingers can go numb on the side of my hand, it's sciatic nerve and, you know, different things like that. I also run, so um, a lot of different things can cause the problem on my right side, but... The main thing that I have is the brachial radial puritis. And I've even been to uh, like a spine doctor and they wanted to put my neck in traction, which was really painful. So that didn't last long. Um, you put up this contraction and stick your neck and it was terrible. And then I went to a chiropractor and they've done some alignment and that may have helped some. Um, also, um, just just trying to keep my posture straight does help also but what i have found that helps more than anything is just really three simple things one is ice whenever my arm gets really bad or even when it doesn't get bad when it just starts burning and itching i ice it i ice my arm up and get it really good in ice because you don't want it to get really burning and itching because it's so intense by that time it's so hard to get it to stop so i ice it really good for about 10 minutes or more you can take a water bottle and freeze it and keep it in your freezer that's that's a really good thing i keep one of those also or you can just keep some sort of thing with ice and just ice your arm up really 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 good and about 10 minutes or so after you ice it up you can get it's lidocaine four percent you can get this anywhere you can get it at walmart the dollar store it is it's very inexpensive i keep a bottle everywhere i keep a bottle kitchen by my bed and by my dressing table and my purse and my car and my husband's vehicle i keep a bottle of this everywhere i just get the the generic pain relieving cream lidocaine four percent and it works so after i ice it really good i put this on my arm um even last night i felt a little tingling before i went to sleep and so i just put some of this on my arm you just do it like that after you've iced it up that helps more than anything that i have found it's been wonderful but get it early when it starts burning and tingling it's like a cold sore when you start getting a cold sore in your mouth that little burning you take your cold sore medicine and it'll go away quickly but something that has really helped and i just realized i've been taking this for two years now two years in september i found out about this amino acid in the book called the mood cure and i think it's by julia ross but this is called l finlanine and it helps with the nerves it also helps with the nerve in my leg, my right leg. But this has helped me more than anything um, that you can get medicine lines over the counter by anything like that. So I take one of these a day. It's very inexpensive. One bottle is about $11, $12. And this bottle will last four months. So I take one a day. I take it, take this of a morning. Elf Finland Lanine. I get it off Amazon. 
see if you can see that. Take one a day, it's 500 milligrams. And you need to take it consistently. This is not something that you can just take for a while and then uh, quit taking it. This needs to be consistently. So I've taken it for two years now and it really has helped because this year I've only really experienced pain, uh, the intense itching from May to July. I think it is because of this. So from May to July, I have not, I had the intense itching, but it wasn't super, super bad. And now, since July, I've only had it sporadically on my arm, um, you know, two or three times a week, but it's really light. So I just put some stuff, I sit some stuff on it and go. Because if you've had brachioradial puritis, you know it can get very intense quickly. And I've not really suffered with that this year, and I do think it is the l finla lanine. <laughs> I probably not pronounced that correctly. 500 milligrams. And it's a nervous system support, and it really, it really is that. And then don't forget your eyes and your 4% lidocaine. And I hope that this has helped you. I've had a lot of hits on my other, um, when I posted about this the first time, but I wanted to update and say this has really helped me and take it consistently. So hope that you have uh, itch burning free arms. <laughs> have a blessed day.